Good evening and welcome to the Baby Bunting live series, episode 39, tonight brought to you by us here at Brightax Childcare. Uh, stay tuned at the end of this video, uh, there will be a chance to win one of these two incredible seats. Just jump into the comments section and let us know your favourite feature that we cover off tonight. It might be something we cover off or it might be something you already knew about the seat, but jump into the comments section and we'll uh, select one random winner. Um, for either of these two seats, so jump on and, uh, and hold on to the end of the video for that. Before we get into the seats themselves, I do just want to introduce myself um, and just give a quick rundown on Brightax as well and, and give you a bit of an idea about what we stand for at Brightax. Uh, so firstly, my name is Gavin. I'm a, a working dad of two young children, a five-year-old and a two-year-old. Uh, so the, the, the safety and the convenience in these seats absolutely does hit home for me. Uh, there's so many features in this seat that resonate with me as a father. Um, and I think back to the first time my wife and I knew we were expecting and we, we started that daunting process of what car seat do we need? What feature should we be looking for? But also which car seat suited our car? We had two cars at the time, both different sizes. So again, that's something else we didn't have to think about or we didn't know we had to think about at the time. And then walking in, talking to a staff member who they asked us straight off the bat, what car do you have? And sort of took us a bit by surprise. So hopefully what we cover off tonight answers a lot of those questions as well. Uh, so a bit about Brightex. Safety is absolutely at the core of what we do. Anytime we design a car seat, the first thing we think about is how do we make this the safest, safest car seat we possibly can. And it's, it's not just so much about safety. And again, it, it comes back to me as a dad knowing now for, for five years, I've had to put my kids in and out of car seats, knowing that it's not just the safety in the seat, but it's the usability and the ease of use every single day. So knowing when I'm getting my, my now two-year-old in and out of his car seat, or if, as you imagine, you're a first-time parent or maybe a, a parent of a growing family, getting that child or baby into that car seat on a daily basis can be a daunting process when you've got child number two or three bouncing around the car doing their thing. It's about how easy is it and how quick you can get that child into that car seat knowing that they are fitted correctly and safely uh, and then you can focus on child number two and three. So what I mean when I talk about that, I mean how easy is it to adjust the harness? How can I do that really, really quickly and really simply? How easy is it to adjust the headrest up and down? How easy is it to move that seat to make sure that it's comfortable for that child as well? So that's what I talk about when I, when I mention ease of use and usability. How easy is that car seat? Because it's something we don't think about on a daily basis, but if that seat is easy to use and it's practical to use and it's not a chore getting your children in and out of that car seat, then that makes it the safest seat it possibly can. So it's our number one priority, as I said, core. Uh, the safety is at the absolute core of what we do. And we've thought about how these seats are going to be used on a daily basis by you, by you and your family as well. So now when we get into the car seats, so I'm going to now cover off um, our next generation of safety and the newest addition to the B family, introducing the B First iFix. More specifically tonight, we're going to cover off these two seats, which is the iFix Plus series, exclusive to your baby bunting stores. So after this video, whenever you do get the opportunity, jump into store, have a look at these seats, talk to your baby bunting staff members about these two, these two seats. The quality of these seats and the luxury used in the finishing materials in these seats really needs to be seen to be believed. Um, so as I said, I would absolutely encourage whenever you do get the opportunity, jump into your store and check these out. They are incredible little seats. So the B First iFix series is, our, as I said, our latest addition to the B family and our, our next generation in safety, with these seats suitable for newborn through to four years of age. The great thing about these seats is they do offer extended rearward facing, which at Brightex we know is one of the most important features that can be offered in newborn seats. Why is extended rearward facing a, uh, su such a big safety feature? As you can imagine, when you get Bub home for that first time, there's different milestones throughout their life that you sort of tick off and, and, and look forward to the next milestone. First milestone being them possibly lifting their head up or lifting themselves up off the ground or sitting up for the first time. But those milestones don't necessarily relate to a child going from rearward to forward facing. So for us, we want to keep our children rearward facing for longer because we know it is the safest possible position for a child to be in in the event that, that there is an accident or, or, or an issue in the car, we know that rearward facing is going to take the most amount of pressure off your baby's, uh, baby's body 
and put them in the safest possible position if something is to happen in the car. So it's not just that the seat does offer extended rearward facing. We've added features and we've purposely designed the, <coughs> excuse me, the inserts uh, and the materials to make sure that that extended rearward facing is as simple as possible as well. So the first thing we've used in there is Thermo 5 fabric. So the Thermo 5 fabric is a knitted fabric that is smooth on the skin and soft to touch. So again, as you can imagine, bubs sitting in this car seat, we want them to be as soft and as comfortable as possible. So again, I bring it back to that comfort, um, that comfort feature as well. If your bub or your toddler or your child as they grow is comfortable in that car seat, they're going to be happy to stay extended rearward facing for as long as possible as well. There's nothing worse than being on a car trip as a parent and your bub isn't happy in the back seat because they're not comfortable and you start to think about whether you need to change them from rearward to forward because it might make them happier, we've taken that out. We want to make sure that that child is as comfortable as possible in extended rearward facing so you don't have to make that decision before you ultimately wanted to. The next thing I want to cover is the plus series part of the seat as well. So the iFix plus, what makes a plus series that little bit better? There's a couple of things. The first being the memory foam that is used on the infant insert. So again, as you, as you can imagine, your child sitting in this car seat, we'll unbuckle and we'll open this up so we get a better view. As Bub is sitting in this car seat, every part of their vital body is going to be touching where we've inserted memory foam. So this inner insert here is where we've got our memory foam. And the memory foam is all about giving them active comfort all the way through as I said, from newborn to that four years of age. So the memory foam is all about taking as much pressure off any single point on their body and being able to conform to their body, whether they are a newborn or whether they're 12 months, two years old, whatever it might be. It's all about making sure it can conform to the shape of their body. The next great thing as well, if we move the inserts out, so again, this, this is all about the extended rearward facing. So as Bub starts to get a little bit bigger again, we can remove those inserts really quickly and easily. We don't have to remove the insert that, that um, has all the memory foam inside of it. That stays inside the seat. So again, it's just another purposeful decision that was made to be able to assist not only extended rearward facing, but making sure your child is comfortable all the way through the usage of this seat as well. So as Bub starts to grow, as I said, we were talking before about the usability and the ease of being able to adjust this seat. As Bub starts to grow, really, really simple. Press the harness button, headrest goes up. Very, very simple, very easy. Now, the reason I mentioned the adjustable headrest and how easy the harness is, the other thing I don't think we think about a lot as parents is it, it, you want to make sure that guardians and grandparents can use this seat as simply and as properly as you're using it on a daily basis as well. So it's nice and easy to be able to put your own child in but we also want to make sure if somebody else has bub or, or son or daughter for the day that they can use it exactly the same way you can without any hassle whatsoever. The last thing I want to touch on when it comes to the Plus Series is just the extra level of detail when it comes to finishing these seats off. So if we look at the design of the inserts and we look at the stitching, you can see we've taken the extra level of detail with the gold and copper stitching the gold and copper buckle tongue holders and the gold logos over the seat as well. At the end of the day, it's, it's again, safety is at the absolute core of we do, but it doesn't mean it can't be a stylish seat. The finishings on this seat are a touch of luxury that is really unmatched and unrivaled by anything else that's in the market. So again, I, I take it back to jump into your baby bunting store when you do get the opportunity because these seats are absolutely next level. They are incredibly um, luxurious and, and great to look at seats. Uh, so that's the plus series. As I said, we, we sort of break into a few things. Thermo 5, the memory foam, and that extra level of detail that's taken to elevate that seat to a, uh, to a sense of luxury that's only found in the plus series. Now as I, I start to twist this seat around, I'm going to show you a few core features that, that we believe, uh, again, we've done by design to make this seat incredibly safe but incredibly easy to use as well. So as we start to spin the seat around, the first thing you'll notice with the headrest uh, all the way up is this specially designed shell. We call this the protective shell. The shape of the shell has been designed again by purpose to make sure that your child, whether they be of four years of age or a newborn, 
your child's head and torso is always sitting inside the shape of that shell. At the end of the day, it's the seat that's going to make them as safe as possible, so why not make sure that your child is, is sitting with inside the shape of that shell as well? So again, just the shape of the shell is making sure that your child is incredibly safe on that daily journey as well. The next thing we'll notice from the side profile as well is these two big um, brightly coloured belt paths. Again, this is 100% by design. We've designed these colours to be as bold and as bright as possible to make sure that when you're installing this into your seat, whether it be by an, a professional installer or you do just need in a pinch just to move the seat yourself, you know exactly which belt path, the car's seat belt or your ISOFIX point needs to be installed through as well. Again, it's going back to everything's been designed on purpose for this car seat. Nothing's been done by accident. We want to make sure that the car seat is safe to use every single day and it is easy to use every day. Because a car seat that is easy to use is a car seat that is safe to use. The next thing we'll quickly touch on is this advanced SICT. So we've got a deployable system on the headrest as well as on the torso of the car seat. So why are they deployable? The great thing with advanced SICT, this is designed to be able to take any force uh, and disperse any energy before it actually reaches the car seat. The reason it's deployable is it only needs to work on the side of the vehicle that is going to be up against the car door. So if you imagine this is installed in the car and we've got our car door here, this is where the impact could possibly be. So again, it's about dispersing that energy. Again, a really great, um, useful safety advantage. But the reason we made them deployable and being able to go back into the seat, again, I think about it with, with two children myself and every now and then going to school and having to pick up some friends of, of my little guy, it's nice to be able to go, well, you know what, I'm actually, gonna, I'm actually gonna put these in and I'm gonna put it in the center seat where I don't actually need these deployed anymore. And all of a sudden we're back to having a narrower in installed width of the car seat as well. So when you think about having multiple children or carrying around um, your child's friends from time to time, it makes that really, really simple to be able to install multiple seats across the back just by winding those back in. Very, very simple. The next thing I wanna touch on, we spin the seat to the back got these great little ventilation zones at the back here. So the ventilation zones are more for when we're in rearward facing. So it would really be this guy here where, where we would see the biggest advantage with the ventilation zones. But again, imagine the bubs installed in the car. Um, they're nice and comfortable in their car seat. They're all installed correctly. It's a bit of a hot day. So the car is starting to heat up a little bit. The great thing with the ventilation zones is as easy as mum and dad simply turning on the air conditioning if you've got air conditioning in the back, through the feet, through the, the center console, whatever it might be. These ventilation zo uh, zones have holes that meet up from the outside rear and the inside rear of the seat. Anytime you move that headrest, so as you can imagine, bub starts to grow and we need to move that headrest up or down. Anytime we move that headrest, the ventilation zones automatically meet up again. So there is always a clear path for the airflow to get directly through that car seat and into the fabrics of this car seat to make sure again that we've got that extra level of comfort for Bub. So again, we, we mentioned that comfort thing again. If Bub's comfortable and they're happy in their car seat, we can keep them rearward facing for longer. We can keep them seated for longer journeys on the car and they're not going to get upset because they're not, they're not comfortable in their car. So it's these little one percenters that we might not think about on a daily basis that we've incorporated into these seats to make sure they are happy. Uh, on the Thermo 5 again, so I mentioned it at the start, the Thermo 5 does a great job of being able to wick moisture away from bub and keep them dry and cool as well. So again, it's another purposeful decision that was made to make sure that bub can be comfortable. When we incorporate that with the ventilation zones, it, it just makes perfect sense. As we continue to rotate the car seat around, the last thing we do want to touch on here, which uh, I will go to the rearward facing seat, Again, we've got our, our ISOFIX connector points here. So being able to install the iFIX series, whether it be by ISOFIX and latching that into the car, or whether we decide, you know what, we actually don't have a car that has the ISOFIX points in it, we can also install it using the seat belt. So again, we mentioned the coloured belt pass, that's exactly what these guys are for. So again, whether we're going into the rearward facing or we're going into the forward facing mode, it's as simple as understanding that to exactly what point that's, that's going to be installed through. The other thing I wanted to mention here is this is a unique feature to Brightex. We've got a movable tension indicator. 
So we're able to move this up and down exactly where we want it on the seat. As you can imagine, every single car seat shape is different. The angle of what the base of the car seat on is different. So every single car, this car seat is going to install slightly differently. So we've made this tension indicator movable to make sure that it's never in the way and it, it can be exactly in the position that's going to get you the tightest fit in the car. What does the tension indicator do? Great question. So as we look at the tension indicator, it's a really quick and visual tool to be able to understand whether there is enough tension on that belt for that car, to, car seat to be installed correctly. So really, really quick and easy. And again, it might not be something that you think about on a daily basis, but it's that thing that I can guarantee if we took it away, you would, you would notice it wasn't there from day one. So again, really quick and easy visual tool. Is my car seat installed correctly or not? Very, very, very great tool. The last one we're going to touch on is the rearward facing level indicator. So we sort of compare this to a, uh, a spirit level on a trade site or uh, in your tool shed at home. Again, it goes back to we, we've made a visual tool to be able to understand whether your car seat is installed at the right angle in rearward facing mode. So a lot of the time, again, as I mentioned, every single car seat is slightly different. The angle of the car seat is different. So this is just the quickest and easiest way for you to be able to understand, number one, is there enough tension on the belt? Number two, is it installed at the right angle? If I move the car seat around here, you can sort of see that little bubble move there. If you can see that bubble anywhere within sight of that level indicator, you know that your car seat is installed at the right angle. Really, really quick, easy visual tool. Everything that has been designed in this car seat has been done to make sure that your journey as a parent can be focused on what actually matters. You shouldn't have to worry, is my child happy in their seat? Are they comfortable in their seat? Are they installed correctly? None of that should have to come to mind. The things you should have to worry about is, are we, where are we going? What are we going to be doing? What are we doing when we get there? You shouldn't have to worry about your in-car safety. That's our job, and that's absolutely what we've covered off for you today. Uh, I believe that's it. Um, we've sort of covered off the, the, the real sort of safety and key features. As I said, we wanted to keep this nice and light. We, we could spend a lot of time sort of running through absolutely every feature. What I wanted to keep the theme of today was all about the ease of use and the convenience features. What is the practicality and the decisions that has been made in this seat that makes it the simplest seat to use on a daily basis? So hopefully we've covered that off today. Uh, as I said, I would absolutely encourage you to jump into your Baby Bunting store, the B First iFix Plus Series exclusive to Baby Bunting. So please jump in and check it out. Thanks very much.